Hello everyone, welcome back to our video. Today this is um, a video about what people like to call it as Israel against Palestine, but and also I am here to prove that Palestine Palestine is never a country at all. Israel people were there for thousands of years. And they got kicked out by Romans. And yeah. Then in nineteen nineteen ninety something they come back. And guess who arrived? Palestine people. Which Jewish people are there before them? So yeah. People are in Pal uh, basically Palestinians are basically being told a very long history about their own time. And also if people do care about them, like Saudi Arabia, Egypt, um other countries, but they don't allow refugees because they don't trust them. Because one time they basically do raids and that stuff. So, yeah. Because they also got kicked out of their own country by a Aunt Syria, I believe. Um, so yeah. <laughs> it's always not their real country. Has it been for thousand of years because they didn't discover it. So yeah. And also, let's see, let me do a... Research. Okay. Let me see here. All right. Let me try to look for something. You know, so. There is, yeah. Yeah, hold up. Damn. Okay. But, still, Israel owns this country because their children are gone. And they're basically are the basically disciples of their old ancestors. Now people are like, oh, how come uh, it was always attacking Palestine. Well, they are not. They are targeting Hamas itself. But, Ruji, you can't always keep people alert. And also, 
is gonna, you know, they did warm them by papers. Which they also speak in Arabic. They know who they speak. And yeah. And I haven't I known I don't believe in anyone told you guys that. They attacked multiple fronts one time and they won. That means their God is on their side. They are pretty unique. So yeah. Now, whoever support Hamas, you're definitely in a long, you basically support terrorism, and Hamas is using uh, Palestine and their hostages as human shields. So, one, like, and also they did say that they don't like Hamas, and one of the thing, but they didn't say it out loud because Hamas don't like the truth, and also it's just gonna you know that. Palestine's a space based sort of map and just tell people the long story about Israel. If uh if Hamas do win, they will basically kill all Jews. Then after that, they will decide to come after Westerns countries. Then shortly after America, because they want to make sure that everybody uh, believe what they believe in by by using force. Um, I don't care if you support them. They always use people as human shields, which they are doing right now. They attacked Israel on October 7th. This is true. You shouldn't support Hamas in the first place. You're basically brainwashed or you've got feared by Hamas. Palestinian people were surprised by Hamas, not Israel. Now look what Hamas did right now. After they do October 7th attack. They are using hospitals as basically an underground base under the hospitals. They basically blockade the, the roads and stuff. So Palestine people wouldn't escape. And there's some people that is from Palestine did the wrong as well because they also attack Israel. Of, uh, alongside with Hamas, if people say that you know Hamas is freedom fighters, which they are not, they should have done basically attack civilians in the first place. They shouldn't use people as human shields. They shouldn't just take down the border if 
they but they use tractors or bulldozer whatever it is Hamas don't care to damn if you support them or not and also Hamas want to kill basically gay people they are not friends which you know of they seek terror and they want to dominate the whole world uh, for themselves if Hamas do win everybody who is for Israel and Palestinian people you guys are in danger because they suppress their own people like I said it's not his own you can't rely on you know missiles which can can't be guided or rockets or bombs And also, things also make a, you know, the worst. And also, Hamas did use RPGs to civilians. Well, they take like they use RPGs on a hospital. Which, and also, who guess who's control the hospitals, uh, the school and that stuff, Hamas itself, the same organization. They do hate, if someone did this, yeah, and also, just gonna you know, Izzo is in the light to defend herself at all costs. And also wars are also bloody, but if there's a war and there's uh, people that you can't make treaties with, but they always, I would tell you something that, you know, Actually, hopefully everyone knows that if Israel does, does a ceasefire, Hamas will do it again. Again, again. Again, again. Till they dominate all Jews and kill all Jews. No matter if they're Zionists or not. They don't care the damn. Now, you know what is also fish? Russia basically attacked Ukraine one year ago. Hopefully, everyone knows that. Then they are supporting Hamas itself in 2023. Because, yeah. Hmm, that's, that, that is fishy, isn't it? Because it is. Hamas and Russia have one thing in common. World domination. Now, and also, there's few people that you support as well in Russia. God bless them. So, yeah.
And Sam goes to Ukraine. But, majority of the world, even you, including U.S., will support, uh, you know, ISO, except for the ones that don't like ISO at, at the first place. So yeah. Hopefully, everyone knows that Hamas shouldn't be trusted at all. Like I said, wars are chaotic. I know that for sure. But you can't make true, true peace with Hamas itself. That's why it's always tied to eradicate Hamas itself completely. Sure, Ezo is killing Palestinians people, but all wars have a cost to it. And also, Hamas, sure, they are not a only military group, but They basically started it, and it so will end it. Hopefully this clarify. If you have any questions or anything, comment below. I will um, probably make it part two. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. And also please don't and hate anybody and also Blake Hoover support Palestine you know big guy you guys are sending hate 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 Hoover support is all but not all of people that does that but still You guys are not in in Gaza. If we are, you basically would just be surprised by Hamas itself. So yeah, I will see you guys next time.